What's going on, Clicks? What? What up, what up, what up? It's your boy, Dub. It's your boy, Ross. And we in the clutch, baby. Hey. Back to you, ladies and gentlemen, with another video today. You feel me? All right. We're going to be checking out Surviving 24 Hours on Snake Island Challenge. Unhibited. Uh, unhabited. Did I say that right? Unhibited? Let's take no, it I slow. Un 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 in in <laughs> uninhabited. <laughs> there hey, we go. <laughs> all right. <laughs> Learning with Ross. Oh, give me the hobbit it. A hobbit it. Yeah, hibbity hoopla. Give me I the word you said. A uh, primitive fish. <laughs> hey, man. You didn't so, even have to read what was in parentheses. You could have just. I know. I wanted to. Hey, I'm going. I'm, I'm, I wanted to put it out there. I wanted to read the whole title, man. Gotcha. But yeah. Uh, so obviously the guy is white. <laughs> and uh, he's is on. He? The guy. Yeah, is he? What you think? <laughs> I didn't want to say the obvious, but you know. Yeah, my man is white and he's going on Snake Island. The, the, the island's called Snake Island. Okay, hold on real quick because my boy tried to cook you. STK what? Knight, pro nuisancing with Ross. So how you going to roll somebody and can't even say, spell the word? Tell me how. How does that work? I, I don't know. Maybe he's typing too fast. You Carry know, boys be... Boys, he was probably typing too fast. He was, he was, he was quick fast. to the rose. I mean, but you can't throw somebody and then say it, spell it wrong. <laughs> it doesn't work like that. that was All right, man. Uh, let's get right into this one. Should be a good one. Let's do this. I am literally trapped Somebody on said this butterfly island right in now. The sky. A flash flood has just come up. Snakes everywhere. I've seen so many highly venomous snakes so far, and we're going to be camping with them tonight. <laughs> this is going to be one wild adventure. Why, bro? So years back, I actually found an island so deep into the Australian rainforest that's actually surrounded by a creek. All you have to do Aust is say Australian. Yeah, that's so it. That just lets you know everything. Yep. Gotta love you, man. System. The only way to get on the island is if you actually cross the creek itself. And I remember going there when I was younger and realizing how densely populated this island was with snakes. So many species, so many highly venomous snakes, all living in this one little oasis. And I actually nicknamed the place Snake Island and kind of forgot about it, to be honest. But what I'm going to do today is head back to that island, stay there for 24 hours, live off the land, catch my own food, collect my own water, and see if we can find some deadly snakes. Now, the only way to get there is via kayak through this flooded creek system. So let's jump in and get the mission started. Oh, my. <laughs> you don't need to. Bare, yeah, barefoot. Barefoot and all. <laughs> yeah, just a normal Monday. This is where my kayak's staying for the next 24 hours. We've got about a kilometer walk ahead of us, and then we'll make it to the Somebody island. Somebody said, okay, Bear Grylls. <laughs> All right, and we've nearly made it. That rainforest over there is the start of the island. I need to find a shallow place to cross. This is all that stands between me Remember and the, the island. The wallace can give human chlamydia. Yeah. True. That's some crazy drone shots that he's getting. Cub by himself. Man. <laughs> hey, man. He has to get the footage. You know? He has to get the footage for us. We wouldn't have known about this. I don't need to know about it. Some stuff you just don't need to know about. Hey, look, let them let them figure it out. We ain't out there. <laughs> but hold that thought. See, what? That's the problem with that, though, because sometimes people go and catch shit and then come back and get everybody else sick. I mean, that's true. But what are you going to do? <laughs> Nuke it. <laughs> Two words. Uh, nuke it, okay. Uh. So much stronger than you think. Better watch some alligators. Yeah. Really He's doing his bear for the oh. There we go. And we've made it. That was close. I nearly fell then. So the thing about filming, right? You might have seen my camera filming from the other side on the bank over there. To get that shot, now I have to swim back across the river and get it. 
<laughs> this is this is the thing about filmmaking. He's getting these establishing shots. He has to go back to get the camera to go back over to the other side. Natural selection, bro. <laughs> Natural selection. Just to get the shot. He's probably going to only use a few seconds of that. That's crazy. Just walking through here, you can see how all the trees are being pushed over by a flood, and it just makes you think, how high was the water God, like damn. a couple days ago? There's Jeez. trees that have been pushed down like 20 foot above me. There we yes. go. And there we go. Oh, Slytherin would have loved him. Right. He would have been perfect for this. He would have loved it. Appreciate the gift of tears, Captain. <laughs> hey, man. Appreciate you. Appreciate with the five. Gift of tears, man. Thank you so much. But yeah, he, he would have fit right at home in Slytherin. For sure. For one sure. One cheer, one barefoot in the jungle. First snake of the trip right there. That right there Bold is a the golden water. crown we're snake. Be, be so proud. this is a venomous yeah. species, but he's not going to hurt me if I do get tagged. So what he's doing is the sun's just coming out right now, and these guys are cold-blooded. Hey, mate. Hell no. Just laying down next to it. Hey, bro. Is that like a move jump? Like, hey, yo. So this guy is venomous, but I don't think I'm in any danger right now. He got to speak. He got to speak parcel tongue for my Harry Potter fans out there. That means speaking snake. He has to. He has to or something. He got to. There's no way. There's no way. Oh, it's poisonous. I don't think he's going to bite me, mate. And if he. Famous if, last words. Hi. Uh, all right. He just wants to get away. And the way for him to get away is up in that bush right there. Now this creek system is filled with fish. It's a little bit harder now that it's flooded to actually catch Somebody them. Somebody says, see you at the crossroads. So I've been seeing spangled perch swimming right. down these rapids through a couple little sections. So I thought what I'd do is make a primitive fish trap, try to catch a we couple gotta and get cook Dub them and Ross to go camping in Australia. Into a circular you going, formation. nigga. I ain't, I ain't yeah, going. No, no, bro. You got it, bro. I'm good. I'll... I'll... You know what I'll do? I'll I'll do one of those fancy ass first class flights. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll go to like Sydney, stay in a hotel or some shit. Fly right back out. <laughs> and then fly right back. I'm really just doing it for the the, the first class experience. <clears throat> one of them luxury hotel, not luxury planes, uh suites they be having. Yeah, I do that. I ain't I ain't doing this. The fuck? I'm risking my <clears throat> life. <laughs> to do this shit? Fuck no. ...to make a bit of a pool at the end. And then as it gets its name, I'm going to make a funnel that goes from the main pool... Oh, this is pretty it. I'm going to try to scare fish it. into it. We'll see if we can get a few. Wow. Wait a minute. That's, that's pretty tough. Yes. Spangled perch, baby. Put him there. Yes. Why? There was like four more than right. I scared that didn't go in there as well. For a snake to there just go. go in. He's in there. Look. One and two. Damn. Big spangle perch. Oh. oh. Look at that big one just got out. Oh, look at that big that beauty. There we go. I got him. Oh. Yes. Oh. That's a big one. Look at that. Ah! That is a big we are so cruel, bro. Just let him just, <laughs> just take him dead. out of his oxygen. <laughs> the other nigga was flopping, came back not moving. Now somebody else. Ah, hell! Ah, we, we're breathe. cold, bro. Like, will somebody ah! just grab us and just take us in the ocean and wait until we stop moving? <laughs> That's fucking cold. This nigga is dead. Why are we laughing, bro? Let me stop. It's just a it's a crazy thing to just think about. 
No, facts. These niggas, they can't breathe. That's why they flopping all over the place. That's fucked. Man, he just threw him next to the homie. Two more. Hey, homie. Oh, there we go. No! Ah! Oh, ah! me! Ah! Oh, that's a young one, too. And that's dinner, baby. It's a family. Can you imagine a Negro just living life next to you then thing you fighting for your life talking about survive? <laughs> Dog. It is so hot at the moment, hey. There's a massive storm pushing in over there. Since we've now caught some food, I think I'm going to get a fire going before that storm hits and all the wood gets wet and we'll cook up these fish. Dig that out. Perfect. Since this fire is so hard to light, I'll just put them up there in the smoke. Grab this one as well. Oh! Stay mouth like wide that. open, just <laughs> make them start to slowly oh, no. cook. <laughs> there we go. These niggas. Oh! Damn, bro. That with the ground seasoning. <laughs> the ground seasoning. Mud, water, and ground seasoning. <laughs> somebody, somebody said died trying to get some air. Dog, oh, that's fucked up, bro. <laughs> or water. That, that nigga crispy, dog. <laughs> dog, this nigga mad said, I might be white, but I'm not that effing crazy. <laughs> and with sticks, too, man. You serving them up with... Random twigs, fam. All right, so we've caught food. We the have found a couple snakes, but I want to show you the real reason why I call this place Snake Island. I know there's more snakes here. I'm going to finish off this fish, stay in the hey, shade yo, till then. Damn. Hopefully the rain brings out some more snakes. Whoa. Water Hopefully the quick. rain brings out more snakes. <laughs> what I've never heard from anyone. <laughs> Ever. <laughs> yeah, that water rising pretty quick on the cool. Yeah. Literally, look at this right now. News. The water oh. levels are rising so much. Over there is the other side of the island. And I'll show you the creek. There is no Let's way see. that I'm going to be able to get back across that. So I guess we're actually stuck here for the next 24 hours. Or maybe even longer. We'll see how long it takes for this creek to go down. We literally just got out here and a flash flood has just come through this area. Oh, shit. Damn. Damn. What in the no. hell? Nah, Australia different, bro. I didn't even see no rain. Where right. Did, where did I didn't even, unless it was just drizzling off camera or... What the fuck is going on, bro? Like, he was only there for a few hours, and now it's like, all right. Flash flood. Survive, nigga. <laughs> you tell these fish survive, you nah, survive. you survive in the water now. Now, I was planning on staying on this island for 24 hours, but now I'm stuck here. I physically cannot get the across wild. the creek. And it feels different. It feels different actually being trapped here now. But I know that there's a lot of animals Whoa. trapped with me. I call this place Snake Island for a reason. So let's go see if we can find some, I guess. Yeah, look at that. A little brown tree snake uh -oh. trapped in these floodwaters. This is, oh, there he goes in the water. Someone over there. Let's follow him. No! This place is literally dry like five mm -hmm. minutes ago. Yeah, here we go. Another brown tree snake. Let me get some footage of him. Nigga, just leave me alone, nigga. <laughs> leave me alone, nigga. I'm not playing with you. I'm not like those fish. <laughs> I'll bite your ass. <laughs> and cook you. <laughs> Mate. That tree snake has just shot down that hole right there. I reckon that by the rate that this creek's rising, within about 20 minutes or so, that'll be underwater. So many animals getting caught in this flash flood right here. 10 minutes ago, I would have been standing on dry land right here. It's come up so much. That's and you know wild, what this means? Fam. This means there's so much rain upstream. And oh. I honestly think we're going to get hit by it soon. If all this is getting pushed Damn. down, that means a big storm's on its way. Venomous snakes literally everywhere. That's the second brown tree snake we've seen. Snake Island is really living up to its name. So these tree snakes are not only rear fanged, but they have grooved fangs as well. So what that means is the venom doesn't inject like a hypodermic needle. The venom actually 
runs down the back of the fang and into the bite site where it's punctured. And I know people who have actually been saved by this. Let's say they've been walking with jeans on, get bitten by a highly venomous snake, but the venom hasn't actually injected because it's just soaked up in the jeans. Whereas hollow tooth fangs work like a hypodermic needle, but luckily these guys don't have that. And that just proves that it doesn't even have to be bucketing down for a flash flood to happen. It's bringing so many animals out of their little hiding places to try and get cover. Let's go for a little walk and see if we can find any. Yep, there we go. Ticking up. Hey, hey, just chilling, bro. Hey, hey, you wait, coming wait, here, destroy his house, bro. He look at him, bro. He just sitting there kicking it. He just chilling. He bro. found him a little spot to stay dry, and you just came and destroyed it like Godzilla. <laughs> Another one off on the list, that right there is a little small eyed snake. Oh, he's he really go wanting find to some. bite me, hey. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, 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 I no hey. I'd be having to swim across that flash flood if I got bitten by this guy. Highly venomous snake. But yeah, they have a long acting myotoxin which attacks muscles, including the heart muscle, days after the bite. So Whoa. he's doing the old ostrich trick on us right here. He's like, if I cover my head, that means you can't see me, right? Look at him up in that hole right there. This place is literally packed with them. That's really cool. Literally lost count at the amount Nookie. of snakes that I've found on this island so far. And we're just getting started. I don't know if I'm the only one, but this is the stuff that I always thought about when I was younger. I'd always think, oh, what if I did get trapped? I wonder how long I could actually survive for out in the wild. And now we are trapped. There's no saying how many days this creek will be up this high. That creek's just flowing way too hard right now. Bits, I'm pretty sure the flash flood has bought out the snakes, but the amount of snakes that I've seen already on this island is crazy. But some of them are highly venomous. I got so many questions, man. Right. Somebody said the t-shirt says it all. Yeah. And just down here Whoa. is yet again another snake on this island right here and a new species as well. So this right here is the coastal carpet python. You would have seen a heap of these guys in my videos before. This guy looks like he's just had a feed. He's pretty Hopper. fat. And that just proves that there is food for these snakes on an mm. island like this. I'll bite you. <laughs> God, oh no. Oh no. Uh uh. Go. 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 So it's been a couple of hours since that flash flood came through, and the water level is dropping a lot. So it's good to know that I'll be able to get out of here. But still, it was so hard getting across the creek when it wasn't flooded. So we'll have to see what tomorrow has to offer. Nuke this whole island. Basically. All right, and we got another snake right there. Would you take a look at that? Uh -oh. That guy sitting in the tree right there uh -oh. is the highly venomous like, who that banded snake. He's gonna turn his back we towards got one. That is so cool. I knew they were out in this area. I'd never seen one here before though. He's so, so happy. So to find one on this little yeah. rainforest island is so cool. If I got bitten out here, would I make it to the hospital in time? There's always a chance, but trust me, you wouldn't be in a good way. The venom from this snake will actually make your blood clot. So I cannot afford oh. to get bitten by this snake tonight. Oh look starting to pour down. This snake would have 20 or 30 little burrows, hollow trees around this area that it'll go and sleep in throughout the year. And sometimes they'll even stay in these hollow trees and logs for up to five months over the colder months of the year. And it's pretty funny saying that they look like a tiger snake because current no one said no, I'm rooting for the snakes. <laughs> All the gold, bro. Apparently, there's been no anti-venom derived from this species. Other so food on the island, get yeah. Other humans, right. snake That actually give you tiger snake venom. Here he goes. Oh, drop down here. Come on, mate. You can go. Make a run for it. And that was so cool. We found so many snakes today. All right, we're gonna let this little fella be and keep looking for more snakes. Let's go. Barefoot, bro. We got another snake. Barefoot. Look at this little fella, right down here. It is literally pouring down rain at the moment, but this is a blind snake. These guys are often mistaken for earthworms, what but you can hell? tell it's a snake by the scales right. on its body. Its head and tail look identical. And although this guy is probably just trying to escape the rain and the flash a blind flies, snake. often you'll see I ain't no out snakes at night, blind. flicking their tongue out <laughs> and looking for termite and air bounds. That's what these guys feed on, and what feeds on them are feral cats, 
foxes, wild dogs, and even bandy bandies, which is another what? species of snake that only eat blind snakes that I have found in this creek system before. So they're mainly a nocturnal species, but he's probably out here in the day. Oh, this thing is drenched. <laughs> this nigga this nigga said, new kid it ain't enough, bro. Uh, they're trying to get away Make from this rat blood. snake. Oh, Facts. I gotta get out of this rain. See you, mate. They don't touch me, nigga. Bye. Can't even see you. That's John Cena. Right. Snake. Let's quickly find some cover. Woo! <laughs> happy, bro. <laughs> hey, I can't, I can't knock his happy. You have a big job. I'm pretty sure it's around five o'clock in the afternoon at the moment. The sun's about to go down. Everything's way too wet to have a fire. <laughs> you saw how hard it was raining on me earlier. I've tucked myself up under this little tree right here and this is where I'm gonna be sleeping for the night. Shouldn't be too bad. I bought a spare pair of clothes, so at least I'm not soaked. But yeah, it's been about 12 hours since we've been on this island and man, we've found so many snakes, caught myself some food and yeah, we're gonna stay here tonight. I heard a story from years ago. This guy in Australia was camping on the beach in a sleeping bag. Bag, a death adder climbed into his sleeping bag at night because there's so much warmth in there and they can sense it. Bit him on the neck and he ended up surviving, but he had to go to hospital. That's exactly what I want to hear before I'm going to sleep. But yeah, I'm gonna chill here for the night and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Imagine you just sleeping in your night little little sleeping bag, you cozy and warm. So shit. This nigga warm over here. Let me get next to him. Mm. Then he bit him for just <laughs> sleeping, bro. This thing was missing. Hey, you mighty warm, but I'ma still bite your ass. Let me get a piece ah, of that neck. Yeah. Ah, what, what you what you fussing for, bro? Move over. I need some space. I would have binked the shit out of that snake. <laughs> no, it's an endangered species. <laughs> no. Fuck yeah. Bop, 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 bop. Head hitting the pavement. If I'm gonna meet the king, <laughs> you coming with me. <laughs> I'm gonna jump rope with this nigga. <laughs> Hey, little human, let me slither in your ear. <laughs> it's currently day two. Turned out to be a beautiful day today. The sun's out. I'm still over here on the island at the moment. The creek has luckily gone down. I went for a check earlier this morning. It just. But yeah, it's been 24 hours that we've been staying on this island for. I'm so Same tired. I can definitely go sir. back to sleep, but I got a long journey ahead of me. If you want to see me back here, leave a like. And I reckon if we get to 10,000 likes, I'll come back here with one of my mates and stay out here for 48 hours. See how many snakes we can find in that time here. Yeah, go check us a follow on Instagram at Miller Wilson. Like, Hello. subscribe, comment down below. And yeah, I'll see you legends again next time. Get... I'm going to go for a swim and then get out of here. I need the future is nature. Don't like it. This nigga got 186,000 likes. This nigga gotta stay out there for a month. God damn! That Imagine is... you the mate that he picks. Hey, mate, you wanna. No! Oh, no, Imagine. I don't care. No, I'm not going. No! Oh, don't be a puss, mate. No! Yeah. Call me whatever you want. How many likes they gave you? I don't know why you said that. Right. That's your other friends, but you're my only friend, mate. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, tisk, tisk, tisk. Sean said his mate going to leave him on delivery. <laughs> <laughs> Facts, bro. Because ain't no way in hell. Hey, bro, you trying to go to Snake Island? <laughs> this nigga got 186,000. That is wild, bro. Nah, bro. I'm good, bro. I'm good. Yep. All right. Well, um, like I said, we ended on a lighthearted note, y'all. Uh <laughs> for sure, man. Look, if y'all enjoyed that one, bro. <laughs> y'all enjoyed that. Let us know in the comments down below if you want us to check out some more. Snake Island, Nuki. That's it. That's all I gotta right. say. Uh Kaboom. it's a lot going on with the water anyway. You can't even walk without it raining and then a flash flood coming out of nowhere. I mean right. we won't miss it. But Love you guys. Continue to spray love, be love as usual. Share our videos, follow your boys on Instagram, and we catch y'all in the next one. Peace out. Already. from Houston. If you got a problem, then we got the solutions. And there's no illusion. I made this shit happen. I'm living life lucid. I'm switching my strategies.
Now they hate on me cause I'm causing casualties But why are they after me? Deep inside they know they can't handle half of me